the anti-boyfriend tag and I actually did not know this tag even existed until I think it was like two or three days ago. Um, I was just looking at random videos and like this popped up in my news feed. Not in my news feed. It just popped up somewhere like you know where they kind of show you all the like suggested videos. Um, so this um, tag came out and I decided this looks like a really fun tag and I really want to do it. So without further ado, here is the anti-boyfriend tag. So question number one is what is one... Oh, I keep messing up. What is the one most important quality you look for in a guy? So for me, I think it is just a genuinely sweet person. That is like my number one. Like they just have to be sweet and like nice to everyone. Like, because if you're not nice like to like everyone, I don't know. That's just like why would you want someone that's like really rude? I don't know. Um, number two, um, what quality is a turn off? So a quality that I really do not like is just snobbiness, cockiness kind of thing. Um, it's just people who think they're like, they know everything and anything you say is wrong and that they're just not like narcissistic almost. Um, so yeah, definitely a turn off. Um, number three, um, what physical feature do you notice on the opposite sex? Eyes is something I notice, um, especially colored eyes. I always like I'll be I'll, like I'm not trying to be like creepy, but if you have colored eyes, like I just like oh my goodness, you know, beautiful eyes, you know, kind of thing. Um, so that's definitely eyes is definitely a qual uh, a feature that I notice. Number four, uh, describe your dream date. My dream date, I think, would be anything really like old-fashioned in a way I guess like I have two ideal like dream dates it one would be like like going to like a not a theme park but going to like a, a fair and just like riding the ferris wheel and like like playing all the little carnival games and you know like that kind of stuff like that's like my dream date that's number one and number two would be to go to like a drive-in movie and just you know drive-in movies that's pretty awesome um so those are definitely like my two those are like kind of tied um on my list so number five um who would your celebrity boyfriend be i think okay i think i have like three which is probably bad so adam levine is one um Chris Evans, aka Captain America, is number two. Um, I think they're kind of tied, and I think that's it. And, oh, well, from Once Upon a Time, Captain Hook, I think he's very attractive, so I think he would be my number three. So, yeah, he, those three are like my, they would be my celebrity boyfriend. Number six. Um, what is your relationship deal breaker? Something that you might end a relationship because of. So, I think if they don't get along with my family, or, well, and, um, and if they just, like, really, like, I don't know how to explain it. Kind of like they don't, I'm not going to say they don't, how do you explain this? Um... Like, if they don't treat you the right way, like, like they're not, like, respectful or, you know, kind of like that. Those are definitely deal breakers. Number seven. Uh, what is your relation... Well, I already did that one, didn't I? Uh, what is your relationship deal maker? Something you would like a guy to do in your relationship. So, I think... I think something that I like again going back with the like really like old-fashioned kind of thing like writing me a letter or like bringing me flowers kind of thing you know that's kind of something I think is definitely a plus um I don't know I think I have like a very like old mind like I guess like I I don't know like I I visualize relationships to be kind of like the old like the old days, like, you know, like, 
they ask your dad if they can take you out kind of thing. Okay, number eight. Um, what eye and hair color do you prefer? So eyes, like I said, anything colored, not brown. I have brown eyes, so kind of like anything that's not brown because like everyone I am around, like family-wise, is all, they all have brown eyes. Um, so definitely blue eyes or green eyes or hazel eyes, anything other than brown kind of thing. Like I, like I said, I kind of noticed eyes first. Um, and then for hair color, so I've always kind of had this vision, kind of, not a vision, but like kind of like the ideal person and they kind of look like Prince Eric from The Little Mermaid. And I, Mermaid and I know that sounds really like ridiculously funny but that was kind of like who I envisioned like dark hair and the blue eyes you know so that's kind of that's kind of what I those are kind of like my what I prefer in eyes and hair um so number nine um he buys you a gift what would it be so obviously like I said something like flowers or I'm not a big fan of chocolate so not anything chocolatey. I think like a bag of like hot fries is like my kind of thing. Um, anything like, um, I don't know. That's kind of a hard question because I really don't know what I, like what kind of gift someone would, would give me. Like I'd like, if you give me flowers, like I'll be like, thank you, you know, kind of thing. Cause I really like flowers and my rooms never have flowers. So probably flowers. Number 10. Would you say you have a type? If so, what is your type? So I think, I think we kind of, I kind of discussed this. Me and my friend, we were kind of talking about what our types would be. And we were talking kind of about why Adam Levine is so attractive. And then we kind of just like, well, he has, you know, the nice hair and he dresses nice. And, you know, he has, I guess he has like the, he looks like a bad boy, but he's a good boy. I don't know if that even makes sense like he's got the beard going on and like the tattoos and like he dresses nice though like he doesn't dress like like bad you know so I think that's my type my type is like guys who can who dress nice for one because we were oh, this is another thing I was talking about with my sister a long time ago but we we're talking about how like like it looks weird when girls look all pretty and like dressed up or like or like they're they're regular clothes but they look really like nice and the guy next to them is wearing like these sagging pants and like really large t-shirt and like it just it kind of doesn't match so I was kind of that's kind of my thing like if I dress nice I think like the person I'm with should dress nice too like I don't know we just have to have like we don't have to be matching you just have to have a nice sense of style you know um, so definitely kind of like, I don't know, because I think also that like, oh sorry, I'm getting an inch in my eye. Oh. Also, um, I think kind of like, just like really like masculine, like manly, like I am, I am a man kind of thing, which is kind of like the beard going on and like tattoos to make them look really like edgy and like don't mess with me kind of thing. So yeah, I think that's my type nice dressers with nice hair maybe a little bit of facial hair and tattoos which is probably bad oh well um so that is all the questions for the anti-boyfriend tag i hope you all enjoyed this if you guys have any questions like always leave them down below um and i think that's it i hope you all are having a very merry christmas season and i will hope to see you guys in the next video I don't know what I'm doing with my hands right now. Uh, bye, guys.